Turning to more local coverage now, state and local officials are going to pause today to honor the many men and women who have served and fought for our country. Now we're learning more about thanks given to a local veteran that he says he will never forget. Island reporter Tadavik Aprikian is live in Cranston now with more. Well, Veterans Day is, of course, the day to thank our veterans for serving our country, including here at Roger Williams Park, where a 5K run will happen in just a couple of hours. Well, one Cranston man says what he got this year made serving our country that much more special. Sergeant Major Glenn DeCecco with the Rhode Island Army National Guard came home to Cranston after a trip to New York this weekend. He says he got home at 11 p.m. and was tired, but a letter he pulled out of the mailbox caught his attention. The letter had an American flag on it, and while opening it, he realized it was no ordinary mail. Dear Glenn, we want to thank you for your military service. The letter was written and signed by his neighbors, thanking him for serving his country. Men and women like you, help to keep our country safe, and we greatly appreciate your service. DiCecco has spent more than 30 years in service, including deployments overseas. He says this gesture was not something he ever expected. He brought it to my doorstep, and they went from just an occasional stranger saying thank you to my neighbors saying, writing, taking the time, the thoughtfulness, and writing thank yous. DiCecco was so moved by the gesture, he placed a sign in front of his yard thanking his neighbors. He says Rhode Islanders have always supported veterans, and this year, it's a day he'll never forget. And DiCecco says he plans to go to each one of those neighbors personally and thank them for taking the time to write that letter. Live in Cranston with the Mobile Newsroom, Tadavik Aprikian, Eyewitness News.